guys, welcome to Layer of the Like and aka HQ Metal. Now, to me, metal music is rebellion, expression, brutality, non conformity, oneness, victory, and serenity. And in this video, we'll be looking at the best bands from Finland. Now, it's not often that heavy metal is, the name, is named trapped by one of the world's most powerful leaders. But in 2016, then US President Barack Obama suggested that Finland's political system was like its music scene. And he said that I do not want to point out that Finland has perhaps the most heavy most heavy metal bands in the world per capita and also ranks high on good governance. I don't know if there's any correlation there. Me personally, I don't know anything about good governance, but Finland does certainly have a ridiculous amount of metal talent in residence. And I'm gonna give you the lowdown on the bands that put the country on the map in terms of metal. Amorphis helped kick off the international folk metal explosion in the early 90s when they began adding elements of traditional folk and prog to their death metal template. They continued to utilize such elements in the intervening years while drawing upon Finland's national epic, the Kalevania, a sizable work of poetry and mythology. Melodic death metal means virtuoso, virtuoso guitars. Children of Bodom took the spirit of the 80s heavy metal and thrash and modded it to a contemporary death metal framework, helping make solos cool again and in the process, balancing shredding skills with a tasteful hell raising and Bodom became one of Finland's most popular bands before Alexi Leho disbanded them in 2019 and started a new band, Bodom After Midnight. Another Finnish trendsetter, a Nightwish, Seemingly unlike a combination of symphonic heavy metal and operatic vocals effectively launched an entire subgenre of epic female front bands. Ridiculously popular, the band have shifted millions of units to become the nation's third biggest musical act, regardless of genre. Maintaining their status despite changing their vocalist on more than one occasion. A fine example of Finnish eccentricity in musical dedication, Apocalyptica began life as an Another seamlessly insensible combination of musical elements, in this case Metallica and cellos, but gradually moved away from cover songs to instead create a unique combination of metal and classical inspirations. They have earned themselves a dedicated following internationally while also becoming respected enough at home to be commissioned to create or work for the National Opera Company. Minimising the stubbornness, heavy drinking and morbid humour and craziness that one often finds in Finnish extreme metal. In Pearl Nazarene began life as a somewhat primitive black metal band but quickly went, went off into a new universe, entirely with a punky, nihilistic, stripped down and sometimes almost avant-garde assault on the senses. Taking the folk and the metal strains popular within the country and combining them to a winning effect, Tourist were one of the most impressive acts with the full metal explosion that came out in Finland in the last decade. Their use of violin and accordion in historically informed Viking storytelling. Humour and love of the 70s discos have made them a unique and much loved proposition. Another group who became popular during Finland's folk metal boom, interfering one one over fans across the world with their melodic and epic compositions. Somewhat less bouncy than many of their contemporaries, their heroic and somewhat earnest approach has put them in good stead with fans of more traditional heavy metal as the years have passed and they remain an impressive live act. An essential inclusion, if only to highlight the intrinsic heavy metal within popular culture in Finland, Lordi are of course the Monster Kiss inspired costume wearing winners of 2006 Eurovision Song Contest. Their victory made them national heroes. The band, appearing in a horror film, Dark Floors, and opening for a restaurant, even launched their own brand of cola. I'll close out the video, here are some honorable mentions. Kalma, Omnium Gatherum, Warpart, and Insomnia. Like the video, comment down below, and don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more.